everybody in this video i am going to convert nfp to dfa uh, this is automata and series 5 main part 5 first of all we need to create the initial state from the nfa table so this is q0 so initial of q0 of nfa is also the initial of q0 for dfa and ab so we need to write Uh, q0 q1 and q0 now q0 q1 is the new state so write down there as a present state q0 q1 for q0 q1 for q0 to a q0 q1 for q1 to a q2 so after getting the union of q0 q1 and q2 we will get q0 q1 and q2 for q0 q1 for q0 q1 b q0 and q1 q0 q1 Q0 Q1 is already available here as a present state. A new present state is Q0 Q1 and Q2. From Q0 to a Q0 Q1, from Q1 to a Q2, and for Q2 to a Q3. This means say union that is Q0 Q1 Q2 Q3. Uh, next from Q0 Q1 Q2, Q0 to b is Q0, uh, Q1 to b is Q1, and uh, Q2 is b is Q3. Now there are new new two state that is uh, another is Q0 Q1 Q3 from Q0 Q1 Q3 that is Q0 Q1 Q2 and empty mean Q0 Q1 Q2 for Q0 Q1 Q3 Q0 Q1 Q3 Q0 Q1 and Q2 Q0 Q1 and Q2 so this is already available as a present state this is a new state is Q0 Q1 Q2 Q3 Uh, Q0, Q1, Q2, Q3 for A. When we apply A, we will get Q0, Q1, Q2, Q3. For B, uh, Q0, Q1, Q2, Q3. So all output states uh, are the input state of the automata. Now the final set Q3. So this will be the final set, and this is another final set. So this is known as DFA or the given NFA. So thank you very much for watching this video. Share and subscribe it. Thank you.